Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, as the title has said, we had a huge haul, huge haul last night um, on Saturday. It is a Sunday, I'm filming this a really quick video. I'm in my cozies. Um, yeah, it is just a very relaxed day here, but I have been working, since we found so much stuff, I've been working on listing that stuff and some of it's already been sold. So I wanted to film a video before I ship it because I will be packing those up today and then shipping them tomorrow morning. So gonna give you a quick rundown of what we got. Um, don't be shy, there's so much stuff. If you see anything that you like, you know the drill. Leave me a comment, send me an email, whatever it takes and we'll get some of it to you. Just because I say some of it's been sold doesn't mean all of it's been sold. So let's, I guess, just hop right in. But first, I do need to give a quick little plug. Um, for those of you who have not heard, sorry, I'm holding it with my hands. It's so wobbly. Um, for those of you have, who haven't heard of the app called Rover, it is um, a really cool app that focuses on dog walking, dog sitting, dog boarding um, for people who go out of town. And I joined this app on Friday, like I said, today's Sunday, and I've already had five requests and it pays really good. You can set your own price. Um, for my area, I decided to use $30 a night per dog if they're staying at my house and, and obviously a fluctuating if I'm just going and feeding them or walking them, everything like that. But we do have a couple of little, a little guests, so let me feature them real quick. So here's, here's one right here. Hi, pup. Hi, puppy. And then we have his brother right there. So they've been super cute, super good dogs. Um, I will leave my Rover like referral link if that sounds interesting to you. It's been really easy. Um, yeah, they've just been chilling at our house. They don't get on the furniture. They're really well trained. You can pick what jobs you accept and don't accept. And so I accepted these guys. And like I said, we're making some pretty good bonus money on the side. So I'll leave my referral link down below. If you're interested, I'd love it if you signed up with my referral link because we both get bonuses that way. So anyways, let me show you what I got dumpster diving. Let's finally get into it. So I'm going to flip you guys back around. All right, so first off, we found a ton of t-shirts from Hot Topic. This is a Dragon Ball Z, and it's also Champion brand, so that's really nice and good quality. We found this um, My Neighbor Totoro. I don't know if you guys kind of recognize this character. I'm not super familiar, but another brand new t-shirt, and that is in a size small, it looks like, or extra large. We found uh, My Chemical Romance, the Black Parade t-shirt. That is a band for those of you who do not know. They are no, the band has since broken up, but they are super, super big when I was growing up. And I found three of these Harry Potter t-shirts, two smalls, one medium. It says Happy Christmas and it has the Hogwarts logo on it. Really great quality. All these are brand new too. So found those t-shirts. Let's just take you on a bit, a little bit of a journey because I have some of this stuff just scattered about right now because like I said I've been listing them. Oops, it's really dark. Found this big thing um, in the same dumpster. So it must have just been from employees and somebody threw it away. So we love Reese's but we're going to give this to my um, father-in-law, Taylor's stepdad uh, today because he likes Reese's even more than we do. But okay, it's going to get dark for a sec. I mean like look around the house, make sure I'm not missing anything into the guest room. We put all this stuff in the guest room today um, just because we had the dogs. I didn't want any of them to like accidentally get into it or something because some of it could probably be dangerous for them. All right, let's flip you back around and kind of show you what you got. Okay, so we found these boxes. So there's the trash bag, what it looked like. We found these little boxes. Taylor wasn't gonna hop into the bin, but he decided to anyways. And he was just lifting up some bags and turns out one was super heavy. And then he picked out one of these boxes and thought like, okay, like, what is this? And of course, let's see if it focuses. Taylor doesn't know makeup. <laughs> so these are all from the body shop. And let's see if it focuses. There we go. Try again. Sorry, you guys. There we go. So that kind of kind of goes and it's um, fresh nude cushion foundation um that's the shade this one has the fuji peony there's shades from light until dark so it does not matter your skin tone we have found it all and there's three of these per box so if you can just kind of look here 
how many boxes we have and there's three compacts per thing and I looked it up online and these retail for about $30 so per piece and so what I've done um, is I have listed them an entire box so three compacts the foundation I've listed for 15 so it's basically like buy one get two free but way cheaper anyway so really good deal on those i just kind of want to get them moving we found a ton all in these boxes are foundations like this and you can see like i said we found some really pretty colors um, of all different skin types none of these happen to be my color specifically um but lots of different colors so those will be listed um I really don't know. I mean, I'm familiar with these. I don't know the character though. It kind of looks like a Sailor Moon type thing. I'm not sure. Um, brand new thing of, I think this is also from the body shop of eyeliner. It's not going to focus. Sorry guys. Here we go of eyeliner. Still unused and just for fun, this little karate pit, uh, karate kid pins. So some of the stuff is obviously a little bit smaller and dinky. Um, we did find two compacts. One was a uh, tester and the other one was brand new so I'll sell the brand new one and then I'm gonna give the tester to my mother-in-law disinfect it and give it to her sorry guys let me see if I can open it all right there we go so that's what that one looks like this is another just single one it's a pinky color and then this is a couple different colors and that's the one I'm gonna try to sell because it's brand new so really good. And guys, these retail for $35. I looked it up on their website. I thought, oh, maybe they retail for like 20, but 35, it's not a cheap palette. I've never tried the Body Shop's makeup, but I'm sure it's great. We found a new thing of their, let's see, come on guys. Himalayan Charcoal Purifying Glow Mask. So that's fun. Some lipsticks in different colors. I right, know it's not focusing you guys. I wonder if it's because the rug is having a problem. Let's see here. Some illuminating drops. I'm trying to make this a quick video, but tons of different little makeup products. These are all brand new. Some of these are not new as I've already said. And then we also just found same, same concept, just a different kind of foundation. You can see that the packaging, there I am, hey guys, that the packaging looks quite a bit different and different shades as well so but it's also a foundation so I found lots and lots of foundations here's all the boxes of these ones um yeah you can even I'll even show you guys if you wanted to pause it and see if your shade is in here that's how many of each we found of each box so times all this by three because there's also three in these guys we found a big thing of wallflowers I won't show you all of them um, they are a little lotiony. They need to be cleaned. There's this wallflower. There is a cardinal. This one's really dirty, so I probably won't sell it. But um, let's see here. So you guys just kind of see. Found lots of wallflowers as usual. And um, lastly, was just right over here. Um, more just kind of, I guess, smaller things. There's some body yogurt. That one's about halfway full. Um, a tester hand cream. I don't usually wear lotion. I've said it before you guys, but um, I have really sensitive skin, but Taylor might use this or this is just going to my mother-in-law and sister-in-law because they love the fact that I dumpster dive. Here's another mask. This one's like almost all the way full. These um, kind of silly little things. They're probably just from Walmart or their dollar store and employees probably use them, but we'll keep them and throw them into our costume pile. We usually go to a Christmas party that's kind of like an ugly sweater costume party, so these might be a fun addition. Um, anyways, they're just kind of fun, so we'll keep them. And we also found in, I will say these two things came from a different dumpster. They came from I won't even say what the store is because it's probably the only store and I don't want to give like too close of a hint as to where we live or like whereabouts we go, but it's from a specialty store here and um, we went there and we just went to look around and we found these in their dumpster. Um, we tried one of them. They're really good and these aren't even expired. They expire, um, let's see if it focuses. 7-3 of 19. So I think they just threw them away because you can kind of see the boxes are a little damaged. So that's always fun to not get um, expired stuff every once in a while. Sometimes we get some brand new stuff. So yeah, I will end the video here. Um, just, I guess, yeah, a repeat. It was a really good dumpster find. We did find some other little things um, 
that was it, but it was a really big find. Super pumped about all that makeup. That's gonna be a really good seller for us. And um, just a quick couple of repeats in case you skipped through. No blaming you there. These can be long videos. Uh, if you're interested in everything, in anything, go ahead and leave me a comment below or email me and I will get back to you um, if it hasn't already been sold. Like I said, I have already listed some of these things and they have been sold. Oh, and that reminds me, one of the things I didn't show you that's already been sold, I've set it aside, is this little number right here. This is also from Hot Topic. Really amazing packaging. It's perfume, it's Snow White perfume and it's brand new. It's the Poison Apple, isn't that cool? So that's already been sold, but um, still a cool find. So. Uh, yeah, and like I said, I'm gonna leave my Rover link below if you guys want to start babysitting dogs like I do It's pretty good money for not a lot of work and I'll just leave that below. Thanks guys. See you next time